Hold on tight for a wild ride into the world of Karens and Kevins. Prepare for laughter galore as we delve into their incredible escapades. First up, we bring you this Karen who gets mad at a lady sitting in her own car smoking. I know, because I, I don't work, right? And I'm a bum, and you're just being mean to me for no reason while I'm sitting in my own vehicle. How about that? Oh, yeah, whatever. Put me on camera. You know what? I don't give a I don't care. It's okay. Do whatever. Now my clothes smell like stench now. I'm sure. You're you're pretty far away from me. Yeah, whatever. I'm, oh, like I'm gonna come over there and do anything. I'm just you. literally outside is all I'm saying. The smoke is not on you. You're invading my privacy. No, you're invading my space. You bothered me. All I said was, I'm glad I'm done so I can get away from the smoke. What's wrong with that? Oh, I'm going on this side. I wouldn't want to get in your space. Karens always believe they never do anything wrong. Just like this one that straight up cut in line. This woman created her own line at River City Casino and I knew things were about to pop off. How does the line work? I'm, no, you, you were not. You, you, you hopped your over that line so you better get the back out of my face. You just shoved my phone into my face. I don't give a about that. Get the my face. I'm not in your face. You can't hit me either. Get the out of my face. I don't give a if you record. I would destroy your phone. Get the out of my face. You can't threaten me either. Bye. The line starts over here. Yo, it doesn't start over here. You walking through here. No. You're incorrect. And you can't be violent yeah, in a bye. casino. Bye. Bye. Are you going to call security bye. on her? When I did report her, the first response of security to me was, "Do you know you can't I'll record in the casino?" I don't give a f call the mother. They see me right here. Yeah. Hello. And you just shoved my phone into my face. I don't give a. F yeah, I can tell so you I'm don't busy. give a. F yeah. Shove that. Shove that right up. There. There's a line for a reason, and it starts over here. You cut him too. We bring you this, Karen, who tries to get a free night at a hotel, but the workers aren't having any of it. When you encounter a Karen at work, part one. No, this new guys. You did. I talked to you. Uh, maybe not you yourself. Last night. Yes, I made another reservation. You have the confirmation number. No, not me. This stuff is in the room. But did you check out yesterday? I didn't check out. I reserved it. You. With who, ma'am? Because yesterday we spoke and you told me you were only staying until 5.30. I, I, I re-reserved the room. Do you have the confirmation number? How did you do it? No, on my phone. You said on your phone? Yeah. Do you have the confirmation number? No. Sure. Are you able to pull up your reservation on your phone is what she's asking. No, right now I just left the room. So I, I don't, I can't pull anything up for you right now. I just came to down to smoke a cigarette. What's your last name? For Sora. Because I don't see a new reservation and your room says it's, it's supposed to be vacant. So did you come back down and check in? Who did you check in with? Okay. Just, um, I guess if you want me to make another reservation. You had to make, you had to have made one yesterday. I, I did, that's what I'm telling you. I don't see I did. it. I, that's what I'm saying. I don't see it. Or I don't see that anyone checked you back in. Okay. Did you I'll, I'll, make, I'll make a reservation if that's what you want me to do. I don't know what you see I don't know the person's name. Was it a man, a woman? It was a woman. It was a woman? Yeah. Around what time? Last night? Um... Okay, did you look it through us directly, or did you I use a third-party site? I called, like, in the afternoon, so I called and said, you know, I'm going to check um, out. Can you spell your first and last name for me? I redid your key, and I checked right. you back in, and yeah. I charged you up until 5.30, so after that, you yeah, I did the same. I did the same thing again. So did you ever come back down to the desk and check out and check back in? Yeah. Okay, no problem. What, um, can you spell your last name one more time for me? That's why I, I don't know why it's not showing that I didn't. Okay. 
Give me one moment. It was oh, but for yeah, today. What? I just, uh, I'm shocked that, like, my room is already checked out. Probably it's not checked out. out. It was checked out yesterday. You never checked back in. Is what it showed me. But I, who did you speak with? Is the question. Okay. That's what I asked. Give me one moment, man. and let me come and look up for you. Okay. You said you don't know the name. name. Yeah, I don't know the name. Okay, okay, yes, ma'am. Karen keeps on going with her lie. When you encounter a Karen at work, yeah, Bart. I want to speak to a manager. I am now. a manager, ma'am. Do what you gotta do. Okay, we can walk you up. Or I can no, call you're not gonna and... walk me up to my room and show me my phone, ma'am. To ma prove to you that I have a reservation. Ma'am, you clearly stayed in the room past five thirty last night. Yeah, I did because I thought I had another. Netbook. You never booked another one, ma'am. Yes, I did. Okay, so there's no issue. And then no you issue. want me to show should... you proof? Yes, so I can see it because it's not in my system. And what if it's not in my phone? How would it not? How many hundreds of dollars do you want me to pay you to look at my phone, to go to my room and look at my phone? Ma'am, you paid that seventy five dollars bit... yesterday. Yeah. To stay until five thirty. You did not leave at five thirty. You did not make another reservation. I did pick a reservation. That's so that's, that's what I'm what saying. All you have on. to do is show you're me the reservation, ma'am. All I'm asking is for you to show me the confirmation number. You're saying you're going to walk me to my room to show, to have proof in my yes, phone. Yes, because if I don't see First the proof, I can't allow you to stay in that on. room. There's internet, ma'am. All you have to do is connect to the Wi-Fi. All right, let's go. Okay. Let's go. I, I tried to come down here to smoke a cigarette, but is this funny to you? I'm, am I laughing? I'm not laughing, man. I came out to smoke a cigarette, and now you're saying, get out of our hotel and provide me money. I didn't say that at she all. she didn't say that. that. That's what you're insinuating. You're going to go to That's not. I'm making sure. Show proof. I'm making sure that you actually made a reservation, because I already caught you in one lie when you said that you spoke with a woman here. There's no other woman besides me that worked yesterday. I did speak with a woman. You couldn't have yesterday afternoon spoke with a woman, ma'am. That's impossible. Watch as her lies slowly falls apart. You want to go to my room and look for proof? I'm not looking for doing? proof. All I said was show me the reservation, confirmation number that you made. You, just said that you, you said that you booked it on your phone. All yes. you have to do is show me the email confirmation number so I can pull it up in the system and see where the res reservation is because I don't see it. But if I don't see proof of a All new right, reservation and there's not one in let's my go. system... Then I can't allow you to stay in that room, ma'am. So, okay, so now you're telling me that you're not going to allow me to stay in the room. If I don't have proof that you made another reservation to be in that room. Yep, yep. Then yes, ma'am. Yeah, yeah. You need to call somebody. Um, call, uh, call, no, no. no. Call. I'm not going to call nobody because yeah, I'm yeah, the manager, ma'am. Yeah, you do. You're not going to tell me you're going up to my room and showing me proof. Ma'am, no. no. if you no. made a reservation, no. it shouldn't no. be that no. hard no. for you no. to no. give no. me the confirmation. No, number. Just the police. no, no. no. Yeah, because that's what I'm about to do. Yeah. Just I'm just going to call the police to escort you out, ma'am. Okay. That's fine, because I can open the door so that you can get your things, but the police will come and escort you No, you're not you even giving me that option. You're being, like, crazy. How am <laughs> I being? <laughs> ma'am, I'm like, talking you're to you. You're not staying another night. Ma'am. I'm talking to you as calm as I can be. All I did was ask for proof of the reservation. You're being crazy. How? You're telling me that I have to get out of my room How right you now? Me, I didn't say. Right? Do you have proof of the reservation, ma'am? That's all I said. I don't know. You can go look at my phone. You can search. Do whatever you want to do. Ma'am. Search for what? All you have to do is pull it up. My phone isn't on. Just go. Just it's go to just my room. It's just connected to the just internet. Go to my room. That's fine. I need to have a cigarette. If How you want to go search my room, you can't. I'm not searching your room, ma'am. All I need you to do is grab your phone and show me your confirmation number. It's not on. My phone is on. So let's go. So, ma'am, how did you book the reservation? You just said you booked it through I your did phone. It. Yeah, I did it last okay, night. Okay, yeah. so all you have to do is show me the confirmation email that was sent to you. That's okay. it. If it's on there, that's fine. It's going. It should be in your email, ma'am. Okay. How does this person work here? Yes, yes she I does. does. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, I'm going outside. You can go to my room and search your room. But she still claims that she has proof. However, she hasn't provided any. When you encounter a carrot, part three. I'm not going to buy the mask. I'm right. 
I asked her for proof and she's getting Go get the proof. Get the proof. proof. Wait. Go get it. She has on a black hoodie. All right, so you need to walk me to my room and get my stuff out. Because you're calling the cops. So, so what, what we're trying to do, what she's trying to do All is I'm trying to do, get your email. Make sure that there's another reservation in the system and you actually pay full price for it. I did pay. What, what do you want? She's like, she's like, okay, so she's not saying. All I said was show me proof, ma'am, and you got, you got all extra. All I said was go grab your phone. I'm trying to smoke a cigarette. You can go to my room if that's what you want. And my whole no, thing is you would can. be able to get back in the room if someone actually reactivated your key. I know. I can't get to my room. I know. But that's what she's trying that's to That's what I'm saying. The with. reason you can't get back in is because you were never checked back in. You were checked out yesterday and you never checked back in. So you just remained in the room. That. I'm How not are you not aware? Make, I'm not trying to make your job harder. Ma'am, I spoke to you yesterday. Yes. I said that you can stay until 5.30 for the $75 that you paid. You yes. told me you would leave before 5.30, yet you're still here. There's no new reservation, and you just lied to me and told me that you checked out and checked back in with a woman, with a woman which is impossible. If you want to go to the room, I mean, that's fine. You have a confirmation. I'm, the thing is... Let's just I'm not waste your time or play. You're not. You just stood up here and yelled and did this. And how are you trying to make it easier for me? All I did was ask you because for you said, your reservation. Oh, yeah, I'll call the cops. You're out of here. I mean, what? what no, I didn't. Ma'am, I didn't say, didn't say anything that? like that. What good is that, ma'am? You're getting loud and rowdy all because i asked you for proof that you actually made another reservation to okay, stay the night here my phone is on then I it doesn't sure matter if it's on all you have to do is connect it to the internet show me an email if that's what if that's how okay, you did it my phone's dead now it's dead oh oh is that another lie so she just told us call, to let's call, go call upstairs you're right call the are coming good the reason you can't get back in the room is because you never checked back in ma'am I don't care. The cops will figure that out. Because you want to call and make me look bad? Call and make you look bad. They're coming to escort you out. When they get here, I'll walk you up to your room. No, I don't get you. I need my stuff. I need everything. We're not leaving anywhere until they get here. I don't, I'm not, I don't know you. I don't feel safe with you walking up there by myself. So, yeah, when they get here, we'll go up. I'm fine. Perfectly fine. No. Because I forgot my lighter. No, because you forgot funny. because you forgot your lighter and you knew you were in a room past the time that you were supposed to be. No, there. I wasn't past the time. Ma'am, and I'll remain another. Oh no, she forgot to bring her receipts. I don't think the manager is going to be too happy about this one. When you encounter a Karen at work part four. No, I wasn't past the time. Ma'am, and I'll remain another reservation. I'll prove that to you when we go up there. How? You just said you don't know if it's on your phone. I'll prove it to you one way or another. How? Okay, my phone is dead. That doesn't okay. mean I didn't make the reservation. When you turn it on, connect to the internet and show me the reservation number. There's no reservation number. Your That's last fine. name shows as checked out yesterday at 5.30 like we agreed upon. Then you tell me you check back in with the woman, which is impossible because there was a man here until 12 o'clock yeah, last night. Yeah, you didn't tell me there was no woman here. That's fine. I don't care. I don't care about stupid details. That's like not that. a stupid detail. That's a blatant lie. You're telling me I lied. You did, man. You keep man. telling me that. Because you did. Because you literally just did. You, you call the cops on me. And now you're saying you're not getting in your room. You're not getting in here until they morning. get here. How are you? Yeah. Liar, so, uh, because ma'am, you, you would be have. able, you would have been able to, to you would have been able to get inside of your room if your key was activated. Your key isn't activated, activated because it deactivated yesterday at five thirty when you were supposed to check out. I know when somebody's trying to run a game on me, you know. I don't want to be here. I want to leave, and you're not letting me leave. Now you want to leave, but it was just like, yeah. you're kicking me out the room now. Now you want to leave. You want to leave yeah. because the cops are coming. Wait, before you say, get the fuck out. I never said Ma'am, she never said that. I never said that. She never said that. You're just making stuff up. I don't even get my kids to leave. Well, you're holding me in here. Well, now you say, you say the cops are coming. Ma'am, if you came for the room, you should have no issues. issues. You offered to pay for the room if I had you. And you said no. There's no Ma'am, you would know if you paid for the room. 
That's the thing. You would know if you paid for a room or not, ma'am. I did pay for the room. You just said. Sue, do you work here? He's a maintenance He's man. Okay. Can I go outside and talk to him? Because you're really so upsetting what? me. Because I'm trying to leave you alone and you're not letting me. Leave me alone. Ma'am, okay. I'm going to just do this. Let's, Please. Let's just step outside. Come on. Like, what Come the on. F I've been trying to smoke a cigarette for the past hour. You have a you won't even let me. And now the cops are on the way? Yes. They better be. They are. I appreciate they it. They better be. Ma'am. Ma they are. Can we go outside, please? please. Uh, now you want to take me outside after you got me this hyped up. Ma'am, you've been hyped the whole time. I'm trying to be yes. No, no. She did it. Thank you. Yeah. Man. Call me a liar all the way out the door. And you work here? I wouldn't treat my place of business like this. I wouldn't treat my place of business like this. Karen eventually exits the building with one of the workers following to make sure she understands the problem. Now she's so confusing to let me have my keys. Okay. So yeah, it's gonna it's gonna be taking another step. Okay. For sure. I don't have my phone down here. I don't have so, my phone. This is how do I know cops are on the way? This is the this is the issue because they they actually gave us a call back. So they'll, they'll be on their way. I don't have but, water. I have to have water settling. Because I don't have saliva in my mouth. It, you guys want to make it real yeah, little? Yeah. It's not little now. Ma'am. Yeah, I have medical problems. What she's trying to do is figure out where your reservation went. And in order to figure out where your reservation went, she has to see the confirmation yeah. so she can figure out why they didn't put it in the system right. She's trying to That's help her. Okay. It's no one's trying to like mad at on you. I'm not mad anything. at you. But when she tells me to get out of her, get out. Like I paid. So that's I, I am problem. getting out. I that's, am getting that's out. That's what we're trying to figure out is what's going on. If you paid for a room, if you paid for a reservation, then yeah, we're trying to check my phone. We're trying. We're trying to figure out what's going on because in your phone, she just wants you to give her the email confirmation. So in the email, it has the confirmation of it. She can look up your reser your new reservation from that confirmation number and figure out why they didn't give you. But she's what they telling me to I'm you. lying. Like my phone is not charged. You can go to my room. That's fine. Having a Karen as a manager, oh boy, must be extremely difficult, especially when she threatens to fire you if you don't get people to sign up for a credit card. <laughs> Jeez. With that kind of pressure, you're never going to keep any employees, dude. And if any Karens want to ask for the manager, who's also a Karen, dude, I think the universe might explode. Let's not think about that, okay? You know, I got different ways that I can look at it, you know, and it's like, you're not asking. I heard you. I stood right there and asked you. You have to ask every single person. And I don't know if it's because it's they're getting job. on you. And I have been asking, Kelly. It's your job. Just like the credit card, it's your job. We are required to sell six credit cards a week. They can track that. And you know what it's going to come down to? I you guys people, are going to lose your jobs because you're not doing your job. Do you understand they, that? The credit card is not a good credit card. And that I is don't the care. It, it doesn't matter. Itself. It doesn't matter. Whether you want to sell it or not, that's your job to sell the credit card. I it's not, just like if you work for Kohl's that. and you sell their clothes. Maybe I don't like Kohl's clothes, but you're going to have to sell them to me. Well, I understand the fact of asking and stuff, and I do. Um, you do not. You do not. I cannot. You do not sell that credit card. Like, you only Maybe wait outcome. and see if it pulls up on the thing on the screen. You sell it regardless if it comes up on the screen. And, and I don't you're know not if the only this is one. just like you're not a random one. thing, but I don't understand the vibes here because it we have not had any issues. Mm -hmm. Me, myself, personally, I'm having a great day. I've gotten $3 of this, and when, and when Lacey left, it was at $17, so you've gotten $2. Right. And, and what cannot, time did you come in today? Is there a requirement that we are? If we, we have to sell, do sixty dollars. I've asked everybody, Kelly. I cannot no, you pull don't like money out of this thing. I have. You have to have twenty dollars today. And what happens if I don't have twenty dollars? Repercussions. 
Take a look at this Kevin's racist meltdown in a gas station. He needs to go back to Iraq. Muslim piece of Yeah, yeah, look. You, you Islamic piece of in my country. Go back to your country. Get the out of my country. Next up, we have come across this lady that gets mad over slow service, even though they are busy as they are the only thing open on Christmas Eve. Whoever the store owner is, they're kind of insane. God damn it, and the battery hot! What's going on? What you mean? I've been waiting on my grandson for 30 minutes outside. Gotta get the whole damn jacket, and the school gotta be fresh and hot. So what he, I'm, I'm gonna tell you what he did. He ordered, he ordered on the kiosk, and then he come up here and pay for it. So he just paid I for it. I'm telling you, his food better be fresh. I'm telling you, that's why, that's why I took it, it took so long. What you mean that's why it took him so long? Because he, he ordered, he ordered, he didn't come up here and order. Why he order, did he order up here? He ordered, because listen, listen to me, listen to me. You better get your hand on no, 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 no. your hand on face. Listen to me. I, 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 I knew thing that was the, the, the new way to order, you have to order on the kiosk. So when he ordered on the kiosk, he didn't come up here and say he ordered, he ordered on there and just sat down. So that's why. But if he ordered on the kiosk, he should have popped up there. He didn't pay for it. But if he ordered on the kiosk, right. he should have popped up on here. He didn't come over here and say he didn't come over here and say anything. But why didn't got a kiosk if he don't order to the cash money? He didn't pay for it. You know what I'm saying? Yes, it does. It does. Come up on the Listen, if, if, okay. if, if, if you pay, just better be hot. That's if, what I'm saying. If, 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 if you pay We're for done. it, we're done. We're done. I'm gonna say you I know. I make sure his food gonna be hot. I get it. You're good, bro. You're good, bro. I get it. It's wild. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Customer service employees must come across some very impatient Karens and Kevins, just like this next one. I'm talking to you like that. How do you like that? Stop thinking I'm going to get my money back. I'm going to get my money back. I'm talking to you like that. I got something for that. I don't care. This next guy landed him in the firing line of this Karen. Why are you, why did you do that? Because I can hear you from where I live and I'm tired of it. Why? Why are you tired of it? Isn't it a good thing to do to preach that's loud. Word? It should be loud. You're loud. You gotta reach a lot of people. Too loud. You gotta reach a lot of people. This is no. good news. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. People no, are in, in, they're in danger of hell. Babies, no, are, be babies are being murdered. Why do you think that's a good thing to do, ma'am? Because that's what I hear every time I hear you talking. No, that's not what you hear. That's not what I'm yeah, doing. Do. I'm preaching yeah, out I here. Do. I'm preaching truth. No. And I'm speaking I up for babies. That. I don't want to hear. Why do you have a you now? Why do you have a problem with Go what home. I'm saying? Go home. There's a stay-at-home order that you are literally not a black bully. Yeah, Go the, the Bible. I need to preach the word of Go God out here. Home. I need to Go reach the people. Home, you I will continue screaming. Would you like that? Because I'm actually finding it really, really relaxing. Well, why don't you explain to me why what I'm doing? Go the f home. Why don't you like what I'm doing? Nope. Are gonna be here soon. I live a block away too. 
I get it. I'm going to I'm going to stay here and I'm, I'm going to continue to preach. I will be out here calling the cops on you because you're supposed to be at home. Go the f*** home! I'm supposed to be. Go the no, f*** home! I'm going I'm to preach. No, you're not. Yeah, I am. No, you're not. I need then to. get a church, pay property taxes. No, I need to go out to where the lost people are, right? I need to go out to where the lost people are. To where the people are. Well, people can go hear home. my words. Go they can home. be convicted no, by the Holy Spirit. Is the neighborhood, and you are not welcome. That's why I need to be. She continues with her rant. You need Jesus, ma'am. He can save you. He can give you a new heart. God can give you a new heart so that you love what God loves. No, that's it. What you're doing is irrational. <laughs> it is the most rational thing you I've done. You should day. love the proclamation of the truth of God. Go the f home. Have you heard the gospel before? There is a stay at home order. Go the f home. Nope. God can give you a new Go heart. He can, he can change you. You need a new heart from God Cathartic. so that you love what God loves, so that you hate what God hates. Cathartic. You yeah, know, you're being you're being completely you're you're being completely irrational, ma'am. You're being completely ridiculous. And it's because you don't love God. You should repent of your sin, put your faith in Jesus Christ, so that you can have forgiveness of sins, so that you can have peace with God, so that you can escape hellfire. Because right now you're you're in danger of hell. You're in danger of never-ending torment. But Jesus can save you. He came to save people. He he came to save people, ma'am. He came to die for people to take their punishment. He came to he came to rise from death. Everybody's life a hell of a lot more miserable. No. A hell of a lot. Well, that's their own fault if it's if they're miserable. This that's their own fault. This Kevin loses the plot after finding out the store is closed. Why are you closed? Tell us why you're closed! Tell us why you're closed! Why, why, why are you closed? I want to go shopping in the Eaton Center! Why are you lock why are you closing your doors? Why are you locking your doors to the public? Why? Tell us the reason why! Why? Tell us the reason! Tell us the reason why! Why are you putting people through this? Why? Why? Why are you putting us through this? Who gave you the right? Who gave you the right? By what right do you exclude the population? Why? Who are you? How dare you do this to us? We are the Toronto public. We want to shop. We want to get into the Eaton Center. It is a public place. It says it's open till 7 o'clock. Why are you closed? Why? Why? Tell us why. Tell us why! Doesn't anyone else care? It's just a spectacle to you. 
is just a spectacle to you? It's just funny? <laughs> Let the police cut off my I don't mind because it's the cops and they're always right. Right? You want to go shopping? Mm. You don't give a do you? Not really. Not really. Then why don't you go off with your camera and stop, stop film. I'm saying I'm not giving you permission to film me. All right? You're in a you don't have place. permission. Huh? But you're in a public No, place. no, it's closed. It's no, closed. No, this is actually a privately held... Uh, oh, really? Company. You're going to explain it to me? Well, tell me why they're closed. I don't know. Cadillac Fairview doesn't want you in. Oh, Cadillac Fairview doesn't want me in? That's why they closed the whole place? Well, apparently. Are you nuts? Are you crazy? I just walked over here for Christ. Karens always think they have the authority to tell people off, just like this one does. It looks like this Karen's spot was taken, so she decides to berate the people sitting there, then ask them to move. Right here. Okay, so move down a little bit. So move down a little bit. Okay? I'm not gonna do this with the two of you, okay? Seriously. Okay? Seriously. Don't give my kid. Don't give my kid. I'll be right back. This dealership worker had enough of this Kevin and tells him to take his attitude somewhere else. And let me tell you, it is so cathartic. Yeah, you are a known problem every time you come here with that car. Take it somewhere else. No one, no one. I took it somewhere else. Did you hear me? I took it somewhere else, and it's they told car. me the battery is still in the warranty and defective. Oh, you people are annoying the hell out of me. Get out. You people are annoying the place that you can abuse no. somebody else. No, no, I don't, don't want to abuse anybody. Out. I just want somebody to drive me home. I've been dealing with this nonsense for three hours. Matter, don't go and throw your car out of here. No one's talking. No one will help you, but do not bring that car here. I'm telling you. Who? Are, what's your name? You can talk to Mike Tolan. Who's your Who's your boss? That is Sally. Go in there and talk to her. Tow who's Sally? Don't bring it here again. I don't like being talked to like you are. I don't care. No one likes me. Where is Sally? You talk to you. You're a grown man. I shouldn't have to tell you. I'm that. a grown man who's been waiting half an hour yeah, for an like Uber. A child. Where's the manager? Are you the manager? You're the service, sir. 